So my name is Jason Weller, and I serve as the Vice President of Truterra, the new sustainability business at Land Lakes. Truterra is the only farmer-owned, farmer-driven sustainability program in the United States. In just a year and a half, we've enrolled over 1,600 farmers on our platform, covering almost 2 million acres, across 26,000 farm fields, and across 19 states. So we have a technology platform called the Truterra Insights Engine and it's a best-in-class technology that connects farmers with the data they're already creating and generating, but puts a new lens on that data, allowing them to understand both their profitability and their natural resource stewardship. This technology allows the farmer to ultimately decide what's the best mix of practices and agronomic systems they want to use to produce their crop, but also to protect the environment. We're giving the farmer an understanding of what's their erosion, what's their soil carbon sequestration, what's their nitrogen use efficiency on that acre and on that field. Second, we give them profitability insights. So we're showing them not just on a whole field basis, but at a subfield basis, by acre across that field, where that field is making money and where it's losing money. And we help them manage that field like a business, but more importantly, help them identify additional opportunities to advance their stewardship. So why I'm really excited about and passionate about Truterra and our Insights Engine is our very strong belief that the future of conservation, the future of farm sustainability is precision. First, we offer them a stewardship ranking for every field in their operation, where we're looking at their risks of loss, in this case risks of erosion, risks of leaching and, and nutrient runoff. We're also looking at their performance around nitrogen use efficiency, their performance on erosion prevention, performance on greenhouse gas emissions or greenhouse gas sequestration, but also on their sequestration of carbon. So we compile all that and we're giving the farmer back a stewardship score for their fields. They can look across the whole operation and look at fields that are doing really well, but they may have a few fields that are trending negatively, going the wrong direction for those different core components on performance. And more often than not, where the field is not profitable, that's where you're also having environmental impacts where you're having erosion, or you're having a lot of runoff, or perhaps a lot of leaching of your nutrients into the water table. So Truterra and the Truterra advisor work with the farmer to come up with a plan to enhance the profitability on that field, but also to address nutrient management challenges in that field, and ultimately do a better job of protecting the environment. One of our great strengths is we're really good at connecting different partners. Truterra works with a number of different organizations across multiple sectors. We work with government agencies like U.S. Department of Agriculture, State Departments of Agriculture. We work with local soil and water conservation districts on the public side. On the private side, we work with national conservation organizations like Pheasants Forever, the National Association of Conservation Districts, and the National Fish and Wildlife Foundation to come together and offer assistance to farmers on their conservation expertise. And third, we work across the agricultural supply chain, equipment manufacturers, and data providers, ag technology companies, and cover crop seed experts, all the same shared vision. How do we help the farmer be more profitable and more sustainable? The Truterra is the team that brings all that together for the benefit of the farmer. Truterra is linking that full supply chain, starting first with the farmer, offering opportunities for the farmer to increase their sustainability, but then partnering with food companies and consumer packaged good companies and grain processors and grain handlers linking together that whole supply chain ultimately to connect the expectation and demand for sustainability back to the farmer in a way that's real and authentic, but importantly, for the benefit of the farmer first.